jump right into it. You want to first start off with taking your scissors and cutting off the edges and making them smooth to make almost a cylinder shape. And then you want to start doming it. Is that I'm going to show you that in a second. You just want to start taking your scissors and just cutting upwards on the piece of foam. This is a kind of hard to explain, but you can just watch. And then you just want to smooth it out. This is what mine look like. Then you want to start off with painting it white. With I just use some gloves and I just do multiple layers of white um, to make it to make the paint go on smoother. That's just what I do. Then I just took some red and white paint and I'll make a nice pink color. This took me a few times of adding red and pink together to make the right pink, what I liked. Then I'm, and I just started applying it with a popsicle stick. Um, I'm just doing a pretty thick layer. You can do very, very thin layers. Mine turned out like this. Once it dries, it smooths out, as you can see. Then you're going to need some red puffy paint to do the seeds on it. I just put my squishy on a toothpick so it's easier for me to hold. And this is pretty simple. You just add dots all over your strawberry squishy. There's nothing really to explain right here. So you can just go in with some green puffy paint. So just start by making a circle in the middle of it, however big you want it to be. And then you just wanna make the leaves. It's hard to, it's hard to explain this, so I still not include it in the clip. Then you go in with some white puffy paint and just kind of make it look like that the strawberry's been dipped in white frosting. And then I'm just now going in with some yellow clay sprinkles um, I can do a tutorial on how to make clay sprinkles if you want me to this is I just chose yellow because I just think it went well with it this is just a clip of me just putting on the sprinkles and some of my struggles This is what the strawberry looked like when I was done with it. I think I like it from some of the angles. Some of the other angles are pretty iffy. So now I'm going in with some darker green puffy paint and I'm doing some little details on the leaves of the strawberry. This is really simple so you guys can just watch and do really any design on the leaves you would, what you want to dip. 